No. Do you think I know what I'm doing over here? No. <laughs> because he doesn't. Pottery is good for the soul. Pottery makes people happy. Hold it like this, you press like that, and then you do that. Moogie has been here since 1987. It was started by three partners. Push forward and you... Put the inside of your palms. Inside of palms, outside of palms. Push forward, push back, swing to the left, swing to the right. <laughs> this is how you do it. No! That's not how you do it. Now what I'm trying to do is called wedging. It's the technique of preparing the clay for this, the wheel. Come, Mr. Bally, Mom, don't, Bally pick, wheel. don't pick it up again, though. And you, should, and you should be only focusing on what you're doing. <laughs> Not singing. <laughs> Tell Mr. G basically the steps to centering. Centering is the most important step. It ensures that whatever it is you're making is balanced. Basically, when you're centering, you have to squeeze it. Oh, so, okay. And you have to lift it. But it's not as easy as it looks. Oh, this is really hard, Master. Yeah, it is hard. You have to have a lot of stamina. It takes a lot of core strength to be able to control the wheel. I eventually, and I mean eventually, got the hang of it. Whoa, my. Once you finish forming your masterpiece, you put it into the kiln to bisque fire. It's sea foam green. Then it's ready to add some color. And this process is called glazing. Do you want to glaze? Yes, I'd like to very much. Well, no, you have to get to the bottom of the pot. Now you have to clean it off with a sponge because it's still dusty. So put it in. OK, you can take it out now. Now it dries, then goes back into the kiln this time to make it smooth and shiny. Now we have a bunch of nut and candy dishes. It's part of the yeah. family furniture. Is that it becomes yeah. part of the home life? Right, it does. But these kids take home much, much more. The kids get a lot of fun, for one, okay? They get a lot of focus, and it's a lot of discipline and direction. When you're lifting, you go all the way up. Something people of all ages can get their hands on. I find that when I come here, I get into a different space. I feel extremely relaxed. It's even better than yoga. It's definitely a creative outlet, something that they can do, something that they can try, you know, just to have that experience. And with enough trying and experience, they can be as good as uh, me. So if you're looking for an activity that brings you the happiness and satisfaction and challenge all in one package. This is where you need to be. Okay, I'm on to the next step. <laughs> you are. I'm, I'm ready for the next step. No, you are.